What's going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Agus Gaming and welcome to part 11 of the Advanced Warfare campaign. I know I haven't uploaded for a couple days now because of the Modern Warfare 3 beta, but we are back now and I cannot wait to see how this story unfolds. And anytime you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to see for the like button for more Advanced Warfare gameplay, make sure to subscribe, turn on notification bell and join notification squad, and without further ado, let's get right into it. I am honored to be the first CEO of a private corporation to become a member of the United Nations Security Council. Unfortunately, my appearance today has been clouded by a flurry of speculation that my company is developing a weapon of mass destruction which would be capable of targeting specific ethnic groups. I want to address these allegations head on. Are we developing such a weapon? No, we are not. Because we've already developed it. But with all due respect, the United Nations is a relic from a different time when nations were unique in their ability to solve the world's problems. But that just isn't the case anymore, primarily because you have outsourced the job to me. I have sent people to die in your wars, so I feel uniquely qualified to tell you your wars don't work. Which is why my priorities have changed from profits to policy. Because politicians don't know how to solve problems. But I do. So let's be clear. I am here to solve the world's problems. And I believe the world's problems begin with you. So what the hell was that? Couldn't tell you, mate. But it sounded an awful lot like Irons declaring war. We took out his WMDs without Manicor. Alice didn't stand a chance. Cormac, you need to see this. Talk to me. We cracked the encryption on the last set of uploads. What am I looking at? Potential targets. I ain't had a fallback plan if Atlas was ever backed into a corner. A preemptive strike. He's gonna try to knock us out before the fight has even begun. Oh, a direct attack on the U.S.? Are we sure Irons is even up for that? So what's the play? No way Atlas can hit them all at once. San Francisco. The entire third fleet is in the bay. I need you two on the ground, now. Gideon, report in. North side's all clear. Wait, what's he playing at? What do you got? It's ravaging. Let's move. Go, go, go. Okay, let's do this. And we're gonna straight away start off with us driving the vehicle. Let's go. We have to intercept the other vehicle. All right. All right. Pursue, but do not engage. Okay. Oh snap, oh snap, what happened? What? Are you kidding me? What was that? Oh snap. Oh snap, let's go. Oh snap, let's shoot it, boom. Of course, we are heading to the San Francisco bridge. We can absolutely destroy the bridge. This is gonna be terrible. Oh snap, oh snap, what's happening? What's happening? Are you kidding me, game? What is happening? Alright, we're driving on the wrong side. What on earth? Oh snap, oh snap, get out of the way, get out of the way. Get out of the way, car, what are you doing? Come on, come on, come on, I have to intercept it. Oh snap, oh snap. 
I'll tell you what. Oh snap, oh snap. Oh what the oh no, oh no, we lost control, not like this. Oh no. Oh I was about to say this mission didn't start from 0 to 200, it started at 100 and continued at 100. <laughs> you good? Cormac, our pit bull's out of action. Proceeding on foot. Atlas vehicles are deploying soldiers. Oh snap. We need these civilians off the bridge. Oh snap, oh snap. Oh snap, here we are of course on the bridge. This is gonna end terrible, we all know that, let's be honest. Okay, plenty of cover opportunities right here with all these cars. Not gonna lie, these remind me of the border crossing map in Modern Warfare 2. Just with all these cars and everything. Alright, you can take a smart grenade right there. Boom, let's go. Okay, we'll have to make our way through all of this. You know what? Let's do this, baby. Let's do this. Now, as we are making our way through this mission, I do want to say, of course, the beta for Modern Warfare 3 had just finished at the time of recording this video. And I'll tell you what, to be honest with you guys, I really enjoyed it, okay? I really, really enjoyed it. Weekend 2 is going to start in about two days' time, this time for Xbox and PC as well, as it will be an open beta for PlayStation users. So that's going to be absolutely amazing. But yeah, so far, I really enjoyed the game, okay? The beta looks awesome. And what makes it actually better is the fact that Sejima Games is actually communicating with its community, okay? And that is awesome. That is something that we did not see. Oh snap, there is drones. Where is the EMP? You can take an MP. Throughout the whole year of Mono 2's life cycle. Alright, another one. Since that didn't work for a reason, you can take one as well. And it's been only a couple days and Sejima Games are already working on updates, fixing issues, like spawn, like the slide timing, like the visibility issues and all that. Oh snap, oh snap, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Okay, how did I escape that? I don't know, but I somehow did. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. They ended up tweeting saying that we're gonna fix all of this come weekend too. And that's awesome, okay? That's all we ever want, okay? That's all we ever want and they're actually doing it and that is awesome, like I said. But the important part in all of this is the fact that not only they're fixing it, of course, they need to continue to listen to the community and fix issues and all that throughout the whole life cycle of, of Modern Warfare 3. Not just now on the bear and at launch. And after launch, they completely forget about the community and all that. No, that will be terrible. They have to continue doing what they're doing throughout the whole year of the Modern Warfare 3 cycle. Cool. And like I said, not just now, but I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. But I really, really hope they continue to support the game. Okay, we're almost there, just 100 and about 30 meters left. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, and I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo and everything. Are you serious, game? What? I'm actually out of ammo for both weapons. What is this? Okay, here, here is the AMR. Okay, beautiful. Let's go. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Almost there, almost there. Okay, these are friendlies. Let's go. That's what we're talking about. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, I have to open the van, let's open it. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? What's inside of this truck? Oh, what the? Oh, it's drones. Oh, snap, what on earth? Oh, the whole bridge is collapsing. Are you serious? But man, oh man, what a mission this was, absolutely crazy. It was short compared to the previous missions, but what a crazy mission. It started at 100 and it continued at 100. But with all that being said, thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed and want part 12, make sure to see for the like button. For 15 Call of Duty, make sure to subscribe, turn on notification bell and join notification squad. And I'll catch you guys later.